one broke his arm. He broke his ulna and his radius. Again, this is, how many times has he broken his arm? Welcome to the vlog. It's competition day. We are ready for, which one is this? Hall of Fame. This is Emily's first dance competition of the season. We are going to Hartford, Connecticut. We're about to hit the road, so let's go. Dance bag, all ready to go. Check for shoes. Yep. Check everything. I just... All right, girl, let's go. You gotta pack it up. Costumes, check. Shoes, what check. Are Makeup, gonna... check. Everything has to go in that bag because with my bad back, I'm not carrying anything. On our way. We are headed to Hartford, guys. Hartford, Connecticut. And it actually snowed this morning. I'm gonna be there at 12.26. We woke up to snow. It was nutty. She's got three dances today. Tap. Please follow the road Whoa. for 26 miles. Let's do that. Um, tap, jazz, and lyrical. But which one is first? L jazz. Jazz. And what's it called? Jackpot? Yeah. It's a little uh, Gaga style. Yeah. Such a good dance. Poker I can't face. wait to see them on stage. So excited. So excited. So excited. We're here. We've just arrived. Park in the car. Here we go. There you go, girl. It's absolutely freezing. Ah, the wind. Suddenly we're on the way home. Emily just finished her tap. We haven't even had awards yet. Got a message from Chris saying that he took him to Altitude, the trampoline park, the new one, and Owen broke his arm. He broke his ulna and his radius. Again, this is, how many times has he broken his arm? Here, you take it. No. I can't even. Hi. <laughs> so we are a half an hour from home. The story is, is that our very good friend Diane happens to be the nurse at the hospital that they're at. So I got to talk to her. And so he broke his ulna and his radius, which I think he also broke before. Like even when I just am speaking these words, I can't believe I'm speaking them again. Um, they went to a trampoline park and he jumped and he landed on it and he broke it. And I don't know any of like the big old details, but they knew, daddy knew it was broken right away. So, Chris and I have been texting clearly and chatting on the phone this whole ride, and they had to set it. So the brake is like a um, an angular brake, so it's not straight across, it's like this, you know? And he, he, so it's like going across, I don't even know where in his arm, if it's down by his wrist, if it's up high, I don't even know, but it's, I know it's his, below his elbow somewhere. So they had to um, sedate him, and they had to, reduce his arm and like line it all back up. So I didn't know if we should do that at Children's. Chris was like, no way, we have to just do it here. I guess the doctor, orthopedic guy is, was there on call, whatever. And he's been doing it for 20 years, right? So no sense putting him in an ambulance, getting him to Boston. He was on morphine, so IV, everything ready to go. And then I just talked to Chris and they've already done it all, which is amazing. It was so fast. Um, and they're gonna take x-rays again to see if it's all straight and lined up, but I just actually got to talk to Owen, and he's talking up a blue streak, because I guess when you come off of that, what is it called, ketamine? Whatever they gave him, 
to put him to sleep. Oh, I learned about his, that in health. With his eyes open. The drug. Really? Okay. Yeah. Anyway, um, he's talking everybody's ear off in the um, wherever he is in the emergency room, whatever he's doing. So I can't wait to see him. Can't believe this happened. Emily's a little upset. She had, we were had this. I'm just annoyed. I know we had this great day of dance planned, and but I told you, this stuff happens. This is what this is life. So um, yeah, I guess Owen broke his arm today in two places. Can you believe this? I can't even believe this. Okay, bye. It feels like my arm is just like super stiff. So like once I try to like pick it up, it's so uncomfortable. Yeah. Because the pain in my wrist is like a little bit is right here. So when I try to pick it up, it feels weird because I can't move. Yeah, like don't my, try and pick it up. Like because I can't move my elbow, yeah. and because this feels like a wrist. Your IV thing. Yeah. yeah, try not to wiggle that around too. It feels very weird. So they just set his arm. They gave him <coughs> some ketamine, and then they wiggled it back and put it in place and put this thing on this splint. But what are they gonna put over this? Nothing for now. And then we'll come back and see the doctor, and then the doctor will take a look and see what he wants to do. Okay? And tell us about what happened when you woke up. So, I woke up and all my vision was weird and blurry. There was two of everything. So, that computer over there, there was, and there's a glass, like, right here again. There's four yeah. doors, and I had four arms. Four arms, and how many daddies? And two. Two daddies. Mm. <laughs> and if you move your head now, it still feels weird, right? Yeah. But you just gotta let it wear off. You're a good boy. I jumped off. I was gonna land on my feet, and then it was super stiff, that trampoline. Because nobody was really jumping on it, I landed on it, and I, my feet went down on my, to my knees, and and I hit my hand on it. You went forward, right? I, but it's weird because um, 
on Friday I was talking to my friends about like broken bones, like how many you've broken, and like oh like I've I'm like oh I've broken two bones on the same hand, and, I'm like, and they're like I've only broken one. I'm like how and and so now I have three broken bones on both arms. Yeah. So I'm probably not gonna go to a trampoline park or play baseball for a while. Yeah. And when you first got up, you were waving your arm around, and you could see it was not right. I'm glad that's over. I'm glad it's over. Yeah. It was. It was all weird, and I had to Wait, grab so it. Wait, so where are Emily and I mean, Aiden and Andrew right they now? They went home with Denise. Okay. And Emily's gonna go home, and then Mummy's gonna come here. Okay. Okay. okay and we, so we, I grabbed your arm real quick, and we got you out of there and drove you here, right, to the so hospital. So hurts on my pointer finger and my ring finger, but. Like my pinky and stuff. Like I can I can feel it when I move my pinky it goes all the way back to the back of my arm. Like you can feel the pain? Yeah. You I did good. Super weird. So when you woke up, what did it look like? Looks so like my hand was just there instead of like the cast. Because this is like normal like skin color. Oh you thought that was so your So I hand. thought it was my own arm, like oh they didn't put the cast on yet. I thought they would by now, and then, and then I looked down closer, and then I saw this white part, and I was like, oh, this is the cast. But the snow sound is really annoying. Yeah, this really annoying. Yeah. A lot of stuff in school. What did you say? I can't do a lot of stuff, because I can't do, like, math, writing. I can't really type right. Like, not a typewriter. Like, I can't type Computer. with my fingers. Because if I have only my left hand, I can't. I'm I'm not supposed to know how to do it just with my left hand yet. Yeah, you'll have to just get used to doing stuff for a little while with your yeah. left. I think. The dream was I was I got up out of the bed with the cast on fully. I and I was gonna. I was gonna go outside. I opened the door up and went out, and I would, f and I kept falling and falling and falling. That's what it felt like when yeah. you were yeah. with the medicine. Yeah, because I, I went out and then I just fell, and it was a super tall building. I don't know why, but it was giant. So it felt like you were falling and then falling again and falling again. And how long did it feel like you were doing that? Like an hour. Like an hour. And it was really only like less than five minutes. Here at the hospital, just going in. I dropped Emily off. I was running out of gas, but here I am. I like going to see my poor little boy. I found him. I just want to see. So it's right about it, like there is where it's broken. And all this going on That's to make sure idea. he's all good. Look, he's got all these contraptions. Look at this. I'm so glad I made it here on time. And look, he's still got the socks. His jump socks from the place? Oh yeah, altitude. Never again. I should have said before I left the house, you know, don't do anything stupid or crazy. How am I supposed to know? <laughs> People he no, perked up. No, it's not. It. Is it that bad, bud? Oh. I can't think about happy thoughts. I know. It's gonna, that Motrin that you just took is going to stop that pounding. I promise you. It's going to go down to a, hopefully a, a two. So you'll be able to, like, just relax. There's nothing worse than that broken bone pain. I, I know. It's awful. You're so brave. And I'm so glad I made it here to see you. Do you want to take it off? Is that, is it, what hurts over there? It's just here. I know. Yeah, they'll come and do that. Oh, buddy. Oh. It's okay, big guy. And then the, when they fixed your arm up and you like took that medicine, you don't remember anything? What they did? Daddy said it was kind of amazing, and you were. When I talked to you on the phone, you were talking and talking to me. You're like, my arm is flat. My arm is flat. 
It didn't look flat before, did it? No. Did it like? Did it have a dip in it? It had like a big bend in it. Oh. Back of his wrist put bending up. And I had to carry him, like walk him in, holding it. Like two pieces. Like with one hand under the wrist and one hand under the arm to keep it steady. <sighs> Because when I held it, I stood there and held it where Mummy is, didn't I, for a long time. So, yeah. what the heck did you do? Did you jump off a high thing? I don't even know what you did. How high did you jump? Like, you said you landed on it? Someone told me you landed on it. Yeah, I, think I didn't land on it. I jumped down and I fell and I tried to stop my fall with it and it broke. Oh, because the trampoline was... It he went snapped. forward. It snapped? Yeah. You heard a snap? Yeah. You heard a snap. How many snaps? One. Oh. Yeah. I think must have, must and have happened. And did you scream? Yes. And, and he did, got up and I grabbed it, right? I grabbed you right away. And then did Daddy, like, did you start, like, I don't know, how did you stand up? Like, I would just be dying. We saw that it was broken right away and I walked him out straight to the entrance and told the manager we were going straight to the hospital and... Oh, my Lord. And got oh, everybody baby. in the car. I didn't know it snapped. Yeah. Like that that sound. Like a like a stick breaking. Oh. Aiden said he heard it too. Oh Don't freak him out. No, but that's terrible. Oh. The fingers. The fingers. It hurts so much. I know, I hope that stops. I'm a little bit nervous about it. You're so brave. So brave. And Daddy said you were just talking about broken bones in school. Who had how many? Man. Yeah. This is the worst break of all. Uh, I can't like read or anything. I can't draw. I can't draw. I can't play baseball. That's what I'm sad about. We're getting better. You can use your iPad. Your left hand. I don't think you should go to school for a while. Take take Monday off. Oh man. Oh, baby. He said it feels better, and he's actually said it feels fine when it's up high like this. Is it a good height? Now you're not holding it up anymore, so. Feels good? Yeah, let's, let's figure this out, okay? Yeah, get your sweatshirt. Now it's freezing out, so. Okay, the fingers feel a lot better when it's in the sling. Make you feel better. You don't have too much in case it makes your stomach not so good. Okay, and I'll drive slow, carefully. I won't hit any potholes. Is that the terrible socks? That's the terrible socks. They're actually nice socks. No, they're not the nice socks at all, Daddy. This was supposed to be a dance competition vlog, and it suddenly turned into a broken arm vlog. Do you want to keep this in your car? Yes, please. Actually, we need to bring it in because about the medicine okay. times. Okay, so I'll see you at home. I'm get him get some, some, I mean, I don't know. Food. He definitely needs some snacks and treats. He's a brave boy. Oh, what do you want for snacks and treats? Like candy? What kind of candy do you like? Maybe. Gummies? Mike and Ike. Mike and Ike would be good. Mike. You like Mike and Ike's? Okay. Ice cream or anything? His stomach can't take it for now. He's got to just have his nice and easy stuff. Mike and Ike's. <laughs> and then we'll figure out dinner for us after I get back. I am absolutely starving. Yeah, well, I think we get Chinese food or something, but we'll figure that out. Okay? Oh, baby. Get my poor little bugger out of the car. He said the pain is down to a three, which is really good. Okay. Careful, careful. See the step there? Oh, teeth chatters. Hang on, Hannah. You got it? You got it? Don't bang it on there. You're good. Okay, so back up this way. Good boy. And I'll shut the door. Do you want me to get you juice? Yes. I'll get you juice. Don't trip. Stay right there. Wait for me. Good boy. 
Well, I need to use this um, sling again. You're gonna use that. You're not gonna take that sling off for a while, buddy, because I think it's helping support all the pain. Hang on a minute. What about here? Yeah, he's pretty messed up, Emily. You should have seen the arm. The arm. My arm looks like this. It would go straight and like that. Like a zigzag? Yeah. It was like a wave. A wave. I, I landed on the trampoline and I heard a big snap. Why did you go there? It was supposed to be fun, I guess. Yeah? How long were you there before it happened? 15 minutes. We were supposed to be there for an hour and 30 minutes. So much for that plan. Look at I the teeth. Cold. No, he's, Emily, he's had so much medicine in him. Oh my god. Let's go sit down on the couch, okay? No, come here. No, stop it. Piper, we have another injured stow person. Did you get a cast? Not yet. Why? Andrew, I mean, Owen, come on. Come on, I'll, put, I'll get the red blanket. No cast yet, we have to get a cast next week. Oh my goodness, the chattering. Okay. Pick your spot, buddy. Piper's following you. Piper's like, what is, look, he knows something is wrong. Look. Do you want a blankie? Oh my gosh. Oh wait, it's not even cold. Piper knows. You a blankie. Hang on, you have it. No. What are you doing? You okay? And I'm gonna, you want me to put a pillow for your arm? You're like a motor. Okay, so we'll put this here and then can you lift the arm? Can you lift the whole thing? It feels fine. That feels fine? That's yeah. good. Oh, buddy. Like, my whole arm was bent that way. Like, I saw the x-ray um, when I was leaving in the hospital bed. Like, I broke both of my bones in my arm, and one of them was cracked fully in half. One of them was cracked fully in half. Yeah, I think it still is cracked fully in half. Yeah, I know. We got a lot of fixing to do. So I'm a little bit worried about that. I can't play baseball anymore. I'm, I'm like, you know I'm bummed about that, right? Oh, just try to stop that. But you know what? Maybe you can be an amazing bat boy. Right? You can still go to games and help. Oh, you know you can stop that. No, Emily, he's had morphine. And more morphine, so? and he's had so uh, so the pain would stop. Oh, he's had a lot of stuff. I got to put to sleep for like five minutes, and it felt like an hour for me. Oh yeah, what was that like? Daddy said you were talking about yeah, it. My eyes were open, though. Like I was, my eyes were open while I was sleeping. And Daddy said it, you said you felt like you were falling. Yeah. Do you remember anything of a dream or anything? Do you you don't know what went on? Did you know people oh, were in? Did, did you know people were in the room working on your arm or not at all? I knew that, but I it just it just didn't come to my mind. What was coming to your mind? Like it, it was super weird. Like I could feel it. What drug was it? That that one that I was talking about. I had to go to sleep. Kenna? Yeah. Oh baby. Can you turn the TV on? I sure can. What can I get you besides TV? Nothing really right now. You're so brave. How much tea chattering? So, yeah, he's been chattering because he's like, 
He's not cold, he's just like coming down from oh, all of the, medicine. well, medicine and shock and craziness, oh, yeah. Right You're a nice brother. It, it looks like you're having like a seizure with your That's what Emily head. said. Aww. Did help opening it. Oh, Aiden, you're such a nice brother. It's ridiculous. I still oh. can't get it in. I can't, I can't grab it. Here. Why'd you get that one? I put it like that. Why'd you get that one? Sure. Please. Oh, does it Oh, yeah. He's he's up for m and That's good. It's a good oh, sign. Sure it stops. Yeah, but. Um, Aiden, I have a question. Were you like right next to him when it went down? Yes. So, were you? Yes. No, he was coming with me to find him. I was, 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 I
So you hurt your fingers as well. Yeah, I think you might have jammed your fingers too. Oh. Oh, it's everyone. Do you want to go to school oh, or you not? <laughs> You're definitely not going to school, buddy, no, on Monday. Did you get a cast? It's like a no, um, not yet. split thing. Mm. Oh, is it going to get a cast on the yeah. What? Burn the altitude sauce. You want to go up to bed? Or do it. I think you need to like find a place to sleep. Poor guy. Love him so much.